High fly ball right field and hit pretty deep. Thompson going back to the wall and gone. Look out, Nicholas. An opposite field three run shot and the Tigers have the lead. Whoa, what a big hit for Nick. Built it down the left field line. This one, if it stays fair, is gone. It's out of here. That boy's cold blooded. Nicholas Castellanos has hit his second home run of the ball game, and the Tigers lead five to nothing. Talk about busting out of a slump. Lindor rockets this one way out of here, and the Indians are on the board. They come right back. Home run number 16 for Lindor. Well, there's your answer right there. Get in there and he put one swing on it. And that ball was way down. He stayed back on it and, and launched it out of here. His 16th homer went over 400 feet into the bullpen. A no doubter. Not so sure that this was even a strike if you look at it. Look at that ball. He had to go down and get it a two seam fastball. His four seamer is like 94. That was 91. Almost looked like a changeup. I think it was, Arch. It's a hard changeup. Swing and a miss. 84. Swing and a miss on a high heater. One ball and two strikes. Swing and a miss. Then a changeup by Scherzer. Strikes out the side. Right down the middle. Unhittable. 3 2 now. Swing and a miss on a changeup. Two strikeouts in the inning. Six on the day. A one and two, a swing and a miss on a slider away. Two balls, two strikes. Fastball up and away. Max wins the battle. Strikeout number nine. Swing and a miss. So Max reaches 10 strikeouts. He is going. Good jump. Swung on a miss. Throw from his knees. And Bowers in there with the stolen base. Gary Sanchez can't do much. I think he got him actually. And the third base umpire, Ed Hickok, said, Stay right where you are. It is overturned. <laughs> go for it. Here they're not going to go for it. As Wendell goes down on strikes. And Severino deals. God, I didn't miss now. A 99 mile an hour fastball. There's a strike three. Crone down looking. Loisaga, five shutout innings, the important thing. One, two has popped up. Right behind the plate. Sanchez looking for it. Who's going to catch it? Severino he jumped over Sanchez and made a backhand catch. It's much easier coming in. Swing and a miss Smith down on strikes. Did he go. Yes he did. This is what really good pitchers do and they finish strong so he is retired nine in a row. As Crum goes down on strikes. He swings and misses. For strike three. Know that he can finish this game, but are you going to allow him to stretch out to 115 pitches? We will see after music and a commercial. Mike. Moments ago, Severino gets the good job. Tap on the shoulder. And that's through for a base hit. An RBI single for JT Real Muto, and the Marlins have a 1 nothing lead. It's been a somewhat productive pitch for him. And now Real Muto. Out to deep center field. Jones is back, and that one is gone. It's a home run for JT Real Muto. A two run shot, and it's 4 0. Like that. This one driven out to center field as Jones is back, and another home run for Real Muto. A two homer day. He's got four RBIs. I think JT's feeling pretty good today. I would say so. Yep, seeing the ball well. That ball cracked to left field, and Rosario continues to have a great series, great road trip, great season. And Rosario is picked off, and the ball is dropped by Gonzalez. So Rosario will be credited with a stolen base. A drive to right center field, deep to the gap, and off the wall. Mao around second. He'll go to third and be held there, and Rosario has another Twins double. Big spot here for Rosario. He tends to like big spots. And a base hit go. to right field. What His third hit of the ball game. And the Twins get the next run. It's six to three. 
Oh. Drive to right <laughs> field. And going back is Chisenhall at the wall. Have what a day, a day. Eddie Rosario. What a day. First pitch again. He walked in the first inning and scored. Since then, he's gotten four hits on, I don't believe, more than five pitches. Unbelievable. What a day for Eddie Rosario. When Yarbrough was struggling so mightily in that third inning, he had Austin Pruitt. That one's drilled deep to left field. There it goes. See ya. Home run, Stanton. Three nothing Yanks. Uh, you talk about the strength. Too many guys can hit him out one handed. Also, his success off left handed hitters out on his front foot, one handed swing, and just a bullet. Fourth season as the Rays manager. He's 40 years old. High fly ball. Center field. Smith back on the track at the wall. See ya. Back to back. Stanton Sanchez. 4 0 Yanks. I'll tell you what, hopefully the success of the last two games is going to go get deep into Gary Sanchez's mind that I do not have to pull the baseball. Last night, three run double to right field. Today, home run to dead center. Now Morrow looks calm on the mound, the big bearded right hander. Swing and a miss, strike three. Carpenter chased a shoulder high fastball. And that's out number two. Cub fans are standing here at Bush Stadium, and there are thousands of Cub fans, more than I realized earlier. Here comes the 3 2 from Morrow on the way. Swing and a miss, and the Cubs win the ball game. Brandon Morrow strikes out Tommy Pham, a high inside fastball, and this ball game is over, and the Cubs win. Now everybody in. Beltre at the plate, only Ranger without a hit. Beltre in the air, deep to right field. Gonzalez is back, and that one is off the fence, and then past Gonzalez. The Shields is in, they'll wave Profar. Here he comes, he'll score, and Beltre to third base, and the Rangers lead by two. Well, Adrian hits the ball well. At the very least, it's going to be a sacrifice fly. But Gonzalez goes back, and he, I think he just misjudged that ball. Because he's watching the ball all the way, and then all of a sudden he turns, and the ball is slightly on the other side of him. Hi, Papa. Tyler White. Tony Kemp, who wants it? White in foul territory puts it away, and the Astros have won 10 in a row and are 9 0 on this road trip, winning in runaway fashion today by the final score of 10 2.